Good morning and welcome to another vlog. Today is Monday. I'm just getting ready to head out the house. We're just getting coffee and I may stop at Target because I need some black leggings and I just kind of want to get some cheap ones right now. I usually like getting my black leggings from Aritzia, but I'm not going to go to the mall just for leggings. I'm just going to get some. I'm just going to get some at Target, I think. So I put my hair in these rollers because whenever I don't, the ends get like really messed up by myself having to use the flat irons. I started using rollers a couple nights ago. Um, last night I used these with the little cover. Prior to that, I did use the ones that are a little bigger and I just used a bobby pin to secure them. And I feel like I like the way they came out better with the bobby pin and the bigger roller. I don't know. It's not terrible though. The rollers definitely help. I'm gonna put some sunscreen on. Honestly, today is like the last day of my cycle and I feel so low energy. Like I don't feel, I don't feel the best. I feel very like sluggish and just really low energy. But I have some work to do so I'm trying to like get myself together. I have the worst week before my cycle. During my cycle, my life is perfect. Nothing bothers me. And then after, like the day or two, like when it's ending, I get like a headache. I feel very like low energy. Like today, I have a headache. I don't know what's going on with this piece of hair. Like why is it doing this to me? We're leaving Target now. I'm gonna head home. I got some nuts and a drink. And then I got my leggings. So we're gonna head home now. Back home, I popped off all my nails while I was driving. So I'm just gonna redo my nails because they were looking really atrocious and I need to film some content. I think I'm gonna do a quick gel manicure today without the, the without the extensions just because I really don't have too much time. Anyway, from Target, I got just the leggings. I got two pairs of these leggings. These are really like cheap, but you know, they'll do for now. And I just got a size large for both of them. My sunglasses in here. And then I also got this for Cali and Clay. This is the uh, Shea Moisture Lotion with raw shea, chamomile, and argan oil. So I got this. Okay, so this is my nail drawer. So we're not using these today. It's so messy in here. But I will take my... I'm going to use this. All right. all right, so I have all my stuff here that I'm going to need. I'm going to just file my nails down. I'm going to try to do this within the next hour. It's 2 o'clock right now, 2.08. So I'm going to try to finish by 3. Alright, so I'm just soaking my hands in this warm water. So then I can use the cuticle remover. I want to do funny bunny but then again i also really love xoxo which is what i had on previously i'm gonna try using funny bunny It's snack o'clock. I'm having a little Chobani as a snack. This is the yogurt drink from Chobani. Good morning. Um, good morning. Just got my coffee. Ooh. I got I got a brown sugar oat milk chicken espresso. I ordered this today. The guy looked very confused and he was like looking through the menu like on his screen I guess trying to find the drink to put it in 
eventually he rides on the cup whatever and then i'm sitting there waiting for for my drink and it's taking a while so eventually he puts it out and it's kind of greenish so i'm like what's this and he goes it's a matcha shaken espresso i said that's not what i ordered sir I was so confused. He was so confused. We were both confused. I was like, no, no, no. The brown sugar oat milk chicken espresso. So I guess he heard matcha chicken espresso. So that's why he looked confused at first because he never heard of that. And I never heard of that either. But anyways, it looked disgusting. It looked like, looked like, like moss, like the color of moss, like green and brown mixed together. It looked nasty. I don't think anybody would ever order that, but, um, yeah. <laughs> Alright. But he did make my drink good today. So happy about that. I went to Target because I actually wanted to get a squatter potty. I've been wanting one for literally years. I never got it. I got it because I fell into a wormhole about the proper methods of laying the eggs and um yeah i was convinced that this was a must i also was convinced by tiktok that i needed to get this okay you guys i don't know i love pink so when i saw this on tiktok i had to have it so i got a pink stanley cup it's like barbie it's baby pink and hot pink the best of both worlds had to have it and then i saw they came out with my new favorite top in this new pink color i have this top in black no i have this top in white and the greenish like army green color um, i showed you guys a couple vlogs back when i got it at target i really love them so they have a pink now and they also have a red i thought about getting both but i didn't and i should have because they were actually on sale this week so maybe we'll go back because Target's also having a little um, promotion. I think it's like if you spend $80, you get a $15 reward or something like that. If you spend $80 two times in, in the month, something along those lines. Because I activated it today, so I did $80 today or whatever I spent. And then um, if I spend another $80 within the next 22 days in one day, then I get a $15 reward. So... I'm sure that's gonna happen they also have Christmas stuff oh my gosh like they have like the cutest little Christmas decor I was so tempted so here's the thing I, as much as I love Christmas I really enjoy shopping for Christmas closer to Christmas I hate the fact that it's October and I'm seeing all this Christmas decor like I really wish they would wait till the end of November because I feel like it takes away from like the season I don't know I saw really nice stuff for the bathroom like just the house in general but I feel like it's too early I don't know also I'm thinking about doing vlogmas this year I'm not sure I'm gonna do it differently than last year because I feel like last year everybody was doing vlogmas and I was overwhelmed in in the sense of like trying to watch vlogs and then I know people were overwhelmed trying to watch my vlog so I want to do it a little differently I'm thinking about doing every other day vlogmas so basically they one and two three and four like that like every other day a video because i think every day was just too much last year yeah i think i'm gonna do it that way also sephora sale is on friday in three days so i'm filling up my cart trying to decide what i'm gonna get let's go home i have to film a couple videos edit submit stuff to a couple brands and then i need to um, upload a video for youtube in write down everything i'm gonna put in my recommendations video for the sephora sale so i could film that probably today or tomorrow and then have it uploaded probably tomorrow <laughs> anyways let's go home just filled up my stanley with some water i do have to wash this one before i use it but this is how they look side by side they're a little different which I didn't notice until now, but the handle, the handle on this one is like different. Um, same size in terms of like how much it holds, but definitely a little different of a cup. The straw is different. I like the clear straw. This one's really cute. I'm going to have this for brunch. It's 1130 right now, so 
This is a Chobani protein. I haven't tried this yet, so I'm going to try it for the first time. Hopefully, I like it. I'm trying to get my protein up. I've been really terrible about that. So, I'm trying to up my protein. I got the mixed berry vanilla. Hopefully, it's good. Not bad. It's thick. I can do this. I can do this. This is very doable for me. It's not too like protein. I can't taste the protein at all. So this is very doable. So I'm going to definitely start getting these and have them for brunch. Because I need to get my protein to like 120 grams. Yeah, it's a lot. It's a lot for me. And I wasn't doing a meal plan before, but I'm also gonna put my I'm gonna put myself on a meal plan like customized to myself because I have tried meal plans in the past, but honestly, like I like what I like. I'm gonna put things that I know I like and I enjoy eating and just customize my own meal plan so that way it has stuff that I know. Hold on. So I'm gonna actually work on a meal plan for myself because I feel like I'm at the point where I kind of want to have a meal plan i feel like i need one just for the next few months i really want to get to my goal weight by december january december is my goal um i'm about 30 pounds away i think let me just double check 31 pounds away from my goal weights i think january is a reasonable amount of time because that will give me three months to get 30 pounds so 10 pounds each month or so so that's my current goal I think so being that it's getting down to like the last 30 pounds I think it's getting harder because I'm closer to my goal weight and that's usually the case with weight loss the closer you are to your goal weight or the closer you are to the weight that you're supposed to be the harder it is to lose weight I told myself I was gonna start filming at 12 it's 11 37 I'm also uploading a video for later today so my computer's being a little loud but yeah <laughs> I just got done filming it took about three hours about three hours that's it i think i started around 12 like 12 15 maybe it's 2 46 right now so just under three hours to film two videos and they're probably gonna be one minute each what is that behind me oh the mirror i thought it was like a mannequin or something <laughs> so um I'm happy to be done. I still have to actually edit, so I'm gonna go edit everything. I'm, I'm gonna make myself some chicken in the air fryer, like just like some chicken strip, and I'm gonna edit. I need to edit all this content, do voiceovers, and submit everything to the brand today because it's due today. So the editing part shouldn't be too hard because i kind of did all the voice i did the voiceovers for the two videos that i filmed already because i did it while i was filming them to make my life a little easier but i have three other videos that i need to do voiceovers for but i don't think they'll be too difficult because i think it's a very like simple process and it's only 30 second to 40 50 second videos so shouldn't be too bad but nonetheless it is so you know work the hardest part is over which i'm always happy when i am done with the filming part because to me that's like the hardest thing that being said i still need to film my sephora star recommendations so i think i'm gonna film that tomorrow i just don't think i'll have time to today since i have to submit this content i'm probably gonna film that tomorrow today i'll upload a vlog that was supposed to go up on sunday but i didn't get um it's sponsored and i didn't get the approval in time so it's gonna go up today and then i'll do the other video tomorrow probably i also have an event tomorrow i need to see what time 
it's at. I don't even know what time it is, but it's like a showroom. I've never done a showroom before, but I wanted to like experience it. So I'm going to be going, um, I think it's factory PR or something like that. But yeah, it's in the city, so we'll be in the city tomorrow, I guess. At least whenever my event is. I think it's in the morning for some reason. I feel like it's in the morning. I think I had to select the time. And knowing myself, I probably selected like 12. Because I like to select early enough that I can get back home before rush hour. But late enough that I can do my whole morning routine before having to go so i think it's around 12 but i'll double check of course you guys will come with me because hello all right so since i've been filming i haven't checked my emails i'm gonna check my email make sure nothing is lingering and i will wait wait i don't know what this is but yeah i'm gonna talk to y'all later Girl, it's Wednesday and I am on my way to this fashion event. It's like fashion and beauty. I'm running a little behind because I was trying to like film and get content, but it was not working out for me. <laughs> it was not working out. So I'm trying to hurry up and get down to the city because it's 11 o'clock. I was supposed to leave at 11. It's 11.19, so... Yeah, that's how my morning is going. And I need to find parking. I think I'm just going to go to a parking garage, to be honest. But still, I need to find a parking garage to park in and then go to the place. So this is going to be like, it's with a company called Factory PR. They do PR for fashion and beauty brands. It's a new season that's going to be displayed. So I'm excited to see what's up. I haven't left the house and gone to an event in forever. So I wanted to just kind of go out and go to an event because i have been kind of like a hermit i've been going out with my family obviously and johnny and stuff but i haven't really done anything event wise even with friends or anything like that you guys so these are um, customized incense for different places okay so this is Henry Rose it's Michelle Pfeiffer's um, perfume line Tommy Bahama and Kenneth Cole. I kind of want to smell this one. It smells pretty good. It smells pretty good. I do think the Billie Eilish smelled good too. Paris Hilton, Kirkumba was definitely something I had in my collection. And I've heard these smell good as well. The Bella Note, 10th anniversary. kind of want to smell the one in the back because it looks nice. smells really good. Okay, so this is Soma's holiday collection, you guys. Like, look how nice everything. I feel like I need this. This is so cute. The bras, everything. Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed. I also love this set. Like, this is so cute. And they even have fuzzy socks and then I didn't realize that Chico's 
White House, Black Market, and Soma were all part of the same group, but they are. This, too cute. The jacket, are you kidding me? I love. And then this little, ooh, this is really nice. I don't know where it was. Oh my gosh, these jeans. It's giving Renaissance tour. what time it was it's late two o'clock so we're gonna go home <laughs> have no time to be gallivanting i did grab a matcha at the uh place first i got the juice and then i got a matcha i wanted to try it it's in a can this is the brand at the light. Oh, all right we finally made it home it took so long in the traffic but we here also, my kids are going to be home in literally like two seconds, so I have no time to myself. I need a self-care day, like I really do. I think on Friday, we're doing a self-care day because, girl, I'm wearing my new Steve Madden boots today. I haven't fixed this. I didn't change the buckle yet, but I really love them. I got my water. I just changed into some casual clothes, and I put some air fryer chicken some chicken in the air fryer to um to have for lunch i'm gonna eat the rest of my fruit i've eaten from this place so many times you guys this place called maman this is the logo this is the name of it here i think it's m-a-m-a-n i have eaten from here so many times but i have literally never stepped foot inside of this um cafe it's a coffee bakery and kitchen shop like i think it's like a cafe i've never been inside i've never ordered myself but i've eaten so many times because a lot of brands will order from this place whenever they have events or like breakfasts or brunches they order from this cafe and the food's always really good i just never never been i have a skims package coming i literally forgot i ordered something from skims I saw that Skims is coming out with men's stuff. I wonder if Johnny would like their stuff. He always likes my skim stuff. Like whenever I'm wearing skims, like loungewear or whatever, he always like compliments it. Besides like the boyfriend collection, like these types of shirts, but all the other sets that I have from Skims, the dresses, all of the stuff, he always compliments those. Like specifically. Like he doesn't even know that they're skims. But if I am wearing them, he'll compliment them. So it's like interesting. Let me show you guys what else I picked out from the um, showroom. I have some stuff coming in the mail as well, but in person I got the Elizabeth Arden products. I got this retinol and HPR ceramide renewing cream. And he said that I can use this in the daytime. It's like, and then this is the eight hour cream skin protectant. This is what it looks like here. So this is a legendary skincare classic that works wonders to moisturize and protect your skin. So I'm not sure exactly what's in here, like what the active ingredients are. Yeah, got this. I really wanted to try these hyaluronic capsules because they looked kind of intriguing. So that's what this is. This is what they look like. Like how cool. These look. I don't know, something about these just really caught my attention. 
There's a reason why they're in capsules. I forget. Something about the formula hit in the air. Something like that. I don't remember. And then the perfume. I got the Tommy Bahama Sam Barth's Seascape. So, this one. Years ago when I used to work at Sephora, I had a um, customer told me that Tommy Bahama makes really good fragrances. And I remember going there and I purchased one. I forget what it was called, but I really loved it. I haven't been back to the store since, but when I saw it today, I said, ooh, let me smell these. So this is, it's very beachy. It reminds me of the summertime. This is definitely a really nice summer scent. This is the bottle. It smells really good. I don't know. It smells really good. It reminds me of something, but I can't put my finger. Ooh, I know what it kind of reminds me of. One of the Victoria's Secret scents, but I think this one smells better like i like this a little better i did get some clips while i was at the event so i think i'll edit those and post them i don't know if i should do a tiktok or just put them in my stories i think i'll put them in my stories on instagram because i didn't really i didn't really do like a uh i don't know i think they'll just be better i don't know I also really need to post to Reels on Instagram. I haven't posted on Reels in like two weeks, I think. So I need to create some content. All right, I'm going to go clean up the kitchen a little bit so then I can cook with space. Good morning. It's Thursday. I'm just getting ready. <laughs> I'm just, just getting ready to go grab some coffee at Starbucks because I have some work to do and I need some energy so Ooh. really need to get to work like ASAP I'm trying to film from like 10 30 to uh, 12 I have an appointment at 1 so I need to be done by 12 30 because i need to leave the house all right so let's head out get the coffee and then get back to work got my coffee i just got the brown sugar oat milk chicken espresso i added the cold foam today because it's thursday okay it's thursday thirsty thursday just made it to my appointment finished filming a while ago like an hour ago and my mom also has an appointment so we're both going talk to y'all a little bit later my appointment oh yeah that's my that's my makeup that i did for my um Lisa for set recommendations the the makeup that i did i the makeup look is on tiktok if you're following me on tiktok i filmed it. i did like a little tiktok of me doing my makeup so yeah check it out all right i'll talk to y'all later because we are literally like right on time all right so we just left the appointment got golden crust i got a veggie then use the I got a veggie patty tradition all right y'all so we are back home all right so I'm back home I gotta upload my um I need to upload my footage to my laptop I need, oh I need to edit the video and then um upload it today so I'm just gonna import the files to the hard drive and then we can get the process going while that's happening i got a package from skims so i figured we can unbox it we'll open it up i ordered from last week so this is the top i got just the long sleeve cotton top very stretchy and I got this nice green color I got this in a size large I don't know why I got large I should have gotten medium um and then I got the bottoms I got then I got the matching bottoms I got the fold over pants I got the fold over pants matching bottoms so it's like a little set I'm just like flared out a little bit I think this will be really cute especially with the Uggs like the Uggs I was wearing today I think this will be really cute to wear good 
good morning it's friday we are on the way to sephora to go shop the vib sale i'm gonna go see what i can find in store maybe i should get coffee first that way i can start drinking it before i get to sephora because i don't really want to walk around with coffee in one hand and a basket in the other hand so just got my coffee i got a brown sugar oat milk chicken espresso with pumpkin today personally like getting to sephora early because i don't like when there's a lot of people in there i literally went to starbucks every day this week i need to get some nespresso pods this is out of control i went to my primary care yesterday uh, i had my follow-up this is my final follow-up until my next annual because she was really trying to make sure everything is good with my blood pressure and uh, she wanted to recheck my vitamin d and b12 because i've been taking vitamin d because my levels were really low back in may so I did my blood pressure obviously and it was normal and so it definitely was the weight because as y'all know i brought caffeine back into my diet honestly my blood pressure and like just everything that was going on health wise was really what pushed me to just start the process to start to start semaglutide i just left the mall i got my sephora stuff i also got a new perfume you guys will already see the haul um the haul is already on my channel so you probably already saw it i got um, i got a Jo malone perfume from sephora as part of the sale it smells so good it's different for me but i really like it and i think it's gonna go so good with the fenty body butter also stopped at airy because they were having a little sale so i wanted to see what was in there and i found a cute set i didn't find a couple things at sephora that i went to they said they had them online but in the store they didn't have them so i'm gonna check the other sephora near me actually this a Sephora in Kohl's as well, but but um, I don't think Kohl's will have it. Yeah, they don't have it in here. It says they have it, but they don't. And that's the only one that says it has it, so I'm not even going to bother. Okay, let's see this other item. I'm going to go check. It's raining now, though, so I don't really want to. Also, I stopped at Zara because it was right next to Sephora, so I, you know, had to. And they had so much cute stuff. Like, Zara has its hits and misses for me. Like, sometimes I'll go in there and I find nothing, and other times everything is cute. Today was one of those days where everything was cute, you guys. And whenever that happens, I have a hard time picking out anything because I'm like, I want it all. I ended up not getting anything. But I think I'm going to go back maybe next week and look again because everything was so cute. Like I couldn't decide what I wanted to get. I just need a couple outfits. I have an event and then I have a Friendsgiving in November. Not my Friendsgiving, but my friend is having a Friendsgiving. So I need to get, um, well, I want to get an outfit for that. Home. I just got home. I went to the other Sephora and I got... Two of the things that I wanted, they didn't have the third item, so I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna order it. I'm Siri always in my business. All right, anyways, so let me get all my stuff. I'll let you get a Jo Malone bag at Sephora when you buy Jo Malone perfumes. That's so cute. Time to go in the house. This is what I got at the second store. Let me show y'all. I got the Patrick Ta lip um, lip oil, lip gloss, really nice, pinky color. And then I got I got the Vegamore hair like scalp brush. And from Airy, I'll show you guys what I picked out. I got this like grayish, like off black set. So these are the pants, they're just sweats, and these are a size medium because they run kind of large. I'm still like a large bottom, but for these I had to get medium because they do run a little larger. And then I got the top in a small, so yeah, I think in tops right now I'm like a medium, but I got a small on this one because the small would be better. So that's my little outfit that I got. I love the little cut in the front. And these come in a few different colors. I wanted this like khaki taupey color. 
they had the bottoms but I didn't see a top in this style so I ended up getting this one which I really liked as well and there's one other color that I may pick up based on how this fits once I try it on. So threw on the set from Airy. This is the top. Like I said, this is a small, so I would size down with this because I feel like the small fits me kind of like a medium. And then the bottoms are a medium, which I would probably also size down on the bottoms because I size down to a medium. I also make my lunch. This is what I'm having today. This chicken noodle soup from Wegmans. It has um, white meat chicken. It's been about an hour. I filmed my makeup for TikTok and I'm about to film a couple videos. I need to do one hair video for um, the brand that I'm working with. And then I also need to film a lip video for another brand that I'm working with. And um, I have 40 minutes to film the first two videos. Then the third video, which is the Sephora haul, I don't have to stress as much about it so yeah we're just gonna get started I'm gonna do beach waves with this little hair tool but um so yeah i'm gonna get to filming i will talk to y'all a little later Ooh, hey y'all it's a lot later i just got done filming a couple videos i have one more video to film which is my sephora haul i didn't get to film it yet because my kids came home and we were just kind of catching up. They started playing their games and I decided to film it later. So I'm going to go to CVS right now. I had to go grab a couple things and I'm going to also get them pizza for dinner. And, um, and then when I get back, I'll probably film the Sephora haul. If I don't film it today, I'll film it tomorrow because I'm not planning to put it up today. I'm planning to put it up tomorrow because I just uploaded the recommendations yesterday so i figured i would do the haul tomorrow and then i'll do the vlog on monday i think so that way there's like a space in between my videos i don't really like to upload back to back unless i have to but i don't really have to in this case i'm excited though to try everything so i really need to film this haul because i really do not like using things until i film them and show them and i also want to do a try on haul where i try the things that i got i got an eyeshadow palette i got lip gloss i got a concealer a powder so i think you know that's a good assortment of products to try so i definitely will do a um a makeup video on someday next week maybe wednesday and then on friday i really wanted to do a sit down video and go into more detail about my weight loss and like from basically take you guys from may till now and everything that's changed i did get my um my lab results in they came in today which was kind of quick because usually they take like a couple days but they came in today and when i tell you every single lab Except for like one, which is my hemoglobin is a little low, but it's always a little low. I'm always slightly anemic, but it's normal. But yeah, just a little low. But anyways, besides that, everything, everything is normal. Like everything. Things that were abnormal for a while are normal. So like, I think I mentioned to you guys earlier, I don't know if I'll include that clip because I was driving and I realized like the mic was set funny and it was probably really loud, but some of my labs were off and that was like a big factor in me starting this journey my vitamin b12 my last visit with her she mentioned that she thought it could be because of my weight that it was abnormal my vitamin b12 and it's normal it's completely normal i'm not taking vitamin b12 supplements my vitamin d is normal but i am supplemented with vitamin d because it was really low and vitamin d levels being low is something that a lot of black people experience because of our skin prevents us from absorbing vitamin d from the sun so 
that mine is normal because i'm supplementing i'm pretty sure i do actually need to pick up some more supplements at the pharmacy but i'm happy it's normal i think there was something else that was abnormal but that's not but it's now normal. oh my cholesterol my cholesterol levels were not in the proper range the bad one was high it's normal which i'm like what the heck like everything y'all and i tell you everything and that she had asked me like if i was eating a lot of like things high in cholesterol and honestly i wasn't necessarily eating a lot of high cholesterol foods but i was overweight so that also can affect your cholesterol levels without you having without you even eating a lot of high cholesterol stuff so yeah yeah i'm a whole new person on the inside <laughs> And the outside. Anyways, I'm going to go to CVS. I definitely cannot wait to do a sit-down video because I feel like it's something that I could go back to as a resource. People can go back to as a resource because a vlog, like, you can kind of get... You can forget where you heard this information in case you were looking for it in the future or in case I was looking for it in the future. Sometimes I say things in vlogs and I myself try to go back and figure it out and I can't. That being said... We go into the drugstore and then also pizza. Let me order the pizza right now so that way when I get there, it's ready because I do not like to wait. Okay. Today's Friday. Johnny has football. I think he has like two more games and then he's done with football. Yay. Exciting. He's excited. I'm excited. We're all excited. Hi, can I order a large cheese pie for pickup? Jasmine. Jasmine? Yeah. Is that all? That's all. Okay, let's take around 15 to 20 minutes. All right, thank you. Okay, have a good day. Bye. Bye bye. Bye. All right, let's go. All right, y'all. Let's just go. There's something else I wanted to get, but I can't remember. I'm not sure what I'm going to have for dinner. I had the soup for lunch, and I had like two pieces of plantain because my mom always makes plantain when she's home she always makes plantains for my kids she makes Callie likes green plantain um but like the chips so my mom makes the chips for her and then clay likes like yellow plantain like soft sweet plantain so my mom makes him plantain so she made him some today and i took two of his pieces and with the soup that was my lunch so i need to figure out what i'm gonna have for dinner i have no clue We've been doing date nights on Fridays after his game, but we didn't talk about it for tonight. So I'm not sure if he's going to be tired or if he's going to want to. So I should probably text him and see just so I know, like if I need to, you know, pick something up for myself or if we'll be doing a little date night. We could also probably just order stuff to the house tonight. I don't know. All right, I'm back home. Um, I've been home for a minute. I filmed the haul, the Sephora haul, and I need to edit. I'm gonna edit it tonight, I think, so that way I could have it up and ready for tomorrow. So I'm gonna work on that a little later. It's 8.50 right now, so basically nine o'clock. And Johnny just texted me. He's gonna be leaving the field at like nine o'clock, so he's not gonna be home for a while. Let's do a little CVS haul, I guess. I got my vitamins. They were buy one, get one free. So I was like, okay, girl, I got the vitamin D3, which is this brand. So I got two. Buy one, get one for a week. Per, per, we love a little steal. And then I got this clip. I saw this and I thought maybe I could try it because I've been trying to use claw clips, but this hair is just a lot, so I can't really do it. My regular claw clips are not working, so I thought maybe this would work. So I'm going to try this. And then um, picked up my makeup remover wipes again. Lately, I've been doing my makeup almost every day because I've been having to film stuff. So I feel like I'm filming a lot of stuff, but y'all are not seeing it because it's a lot of like behind the scenes stuff. So yeah, I'm trying to get my life together. This week, I think I'm definitely getting back on track. I'm actually wearing the lip oil that I got from Milk. I really like it. Love the consistency. I may pick up a couple other shades there was one of the shades that i really liked but i'm not sure if i really cared for the the rest of them so i may get this one shade it's kind of like a like it's kind of like a berry ish type of color so i'm so tired y'all i also need to i am so tired i need to take my makeup off i really don't want to edit if i'm being honest but i need to 
also i was this close to booking a nail appointment because i am <laughs> i'm tired i'm oh i don't I, I think i think i'm getting to a point where i feel like i need to go to a professional so i was i literally was about to book this girl i found somebody who i think her work looks really good i haven't gone to her yet I truly have gone to the shop that she works at but I thought, you know, like when you go to these nail shops, like on their Instagram, they post all the pictures and you don't really know who did what. So back when I went there, maybe like three years ago, I went there twice, actually. Um, the first time was a hot mess. And after the first time, I booked with the owner because I thought maybe the owner was like the best person. And she was good, but it wasn't like the best, you know, like it wasn't like I wasn't. Um, I wasn't wowed enough to keep going back and then I ended up finding someone else who I ended up staying with for a while. I did my last nail tech, I stayed with her for a really long time, but she was but like but I've said this before, she was not consistent. Like some days it would come out really good, other days I was not like happy with it. So I was scrolling Instagram and I actually saw a picture from that nail shop that I had gone to a couple years ago. The design looks really good and they actually tagged the nail tech. So I clicked on her page and like everything slaps, like everything she did. I was like, oh, this is the one. This is the person that I thought I was going to when I went there originally. She doesn't have anything available till next week Friday. So that's why I ended up not booking because I kind of wanted something like early in the week and that's the only reason why I didn't book. I think for November and December, at least I'm gonna go somewhere to do my nails. I actually also wanna get my lashes done for November and December. I just feel like those two things would just help my life be a lot easier. And obviously lashes just makes applying makeup a lot quicker. The only thing is I have a few campaigns that their um, rules basically say no excessive lashes. So I'm gonna have to figure out what they mean by that. <laughs> because excessive to me could be completely different than excessive to them like to me excessive is mega volume lashes you know really thick lashes but to some people excessive is an ardell wispy lash so i don't know what they mean by that um so uh yeah my camera's gonna die i'm gonna take my makeup off and then i'm gonna wash my face Maybe I'll find a movie that we could watch. I don't know if Johnny wants to watch a movie. No clue what he wants to do. He just asked me about food. So we probably will pick something up and then maybe we could have a movie night. I don't know. I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. I think I'm going to vlog tomorrow and then I'll end the vlog. Because I I don't even know what I'm doing tomorrow. But maybe I'll figure out, I'll figure out something. <laughs> Girl, it's Saturday. I am taking off my nails. <laughs> because I'm about to go get them done. Yeah, <laughs> you heard that right. They're just coming off and not, you know, like looking neat. And I really just don't wanna waste my time doing them and then them not coming out. Yeah, so I'm just gonna go get them done. I'm a little behind because I was trying to take my nails off. I should have just let them do it, but I was trying to like save myself some time because y'all know I don't really like sitting in there. So yeah, I was trying to take them off, but it was taking a little bit longer than I anticipated. Also, I'm wearing the new skim set that I got. I definitely got the wrong sizes. The top is fine. I got a large in the top. It's fine, but I could have used a medium. And then the bottoms, I got XL, which they're definitely too big. Like the waist is really big. So yeah, sometimes skim drones a little tighter. So I was thinking it would be like a tighter fit, but it's not. So. All right, so I just got to the supermarket. I'm gonna go grab some things for dinner um, we want to have a movie night with the kids at home so I'm just gonna get popcorn and then I think I'm gonna make a little dinner for the kids so my nails came out pretty good we did dip Callie is hounding me you guys like she's been texting me since I left the house like are you back yet are you done yet are you done yet can you get this can you get that like <laughs> I'll tell y'all when I get in there